Okay, so let's do a couple of fun things uh, that are really going to help your serve. You hear people say all the time, well, throw a ball and it's, it's the same thing as serving. Well, that's kind of true. Uh, but if you don't know how to throw a ball, then you're kind of in trouble. So I would suggest you get out and throw a ball. Let's do it. Remember how you hold a ball is important, just like how you hold your tennis racket grip. Uh, it's the same grip. So see the V in my hand on the ball? That's how I'm going to hold the ball to throw it, basically. And that is going to be the same grip as your tennis racket grip. So it's incredibly important because you get the same action with your bicep, elbow, and forearm and wrist as you do with throwing. So we're just going to throw a little bit. I'm going to try and make them go high because we're always trying to tell you guys to hit up to the ball. And one of the biggest parts of hitting up to the ball is that you have to have your left hand up there to create shoulder angle, right? So my shoulder angle, if I want to throw up, way up high, my shoulder angle is going to be here, okay? So I've got to get that to happen by holding my left arm up there strong, and then I'm going to be pulling it out of the way. I'm going to be pulling it down to help me rotate. But what that does is it drives my chest up. It doesn't pull me down, okay? So it's going to look a little bit like this. I just throw that straight up in the air so it would come back. So now I'm going to grab my serve master and I'm just going to again start from this throwing position and I'm going to see if I can get it to go up. And if I can't get it to go up, then I'm not throwing up and I'm also not releasing on time. Okay, it's got to learn how to release the ball release the handle. Okay, well I didn't get it to go very far, but I did get it to go end over end, which it's supposed to do if I'm pronating, and I got it to go up in the air, so I'm happy with that. And our final thing is just going to be hitting a few balls from a re abbreviated position, which is probably the best thing you can do for your serve. It isolates your toss and it isolates this pronating movement with the shoulder, bicep, elbow, forearm, and wrist. That's where it all comes from. So you see, my, I'm really trying to stop that finish. I'm stopping right here after I hit because I'm trying to get the racket tip traveling in this big arc. When it's back here, it's down to the ground. And without my hand traveling very far, it's down to the ground on the other side, it's on the front. So I wanna learn this action. Most important thing that we can do on the serve. <laughs> 